Hello, welcome back to the Introvert Circus. I hope that you and your dogs are having a fantastic weekend. This is some footage that I uh, took two weekends ago when it was not raining. It has been raining a ton, which is fair. It is spring in the Pacific Northwest or the end of winter and the very beginnings of spring. But this is um, some footage from a outing to the river with the dogs and they had a ton of fun and I just thought I would compile it together into a little vlog of just some of the things that we enjoy to do. So, you know, oh my goodness, Sirius had so much fun digging. Digging in sand is one of her favorite activities, as is rescuing sticks, as you witnessed. Stick rescuing is one of her specialties. She is a branch manager. Um, digging a nice big serious sized hole here it was just such a great day it was beautiful weather it was pretty warm uh and it was a nice time to get the dogs out it wasn't raining and we just love um you know having lived in new york city for 13 years almost with dogs um it was always hard to and we spent a lot of time focused on getting the dogs um, out of the city or to the really great nature spots we had in the city and it, it's just nice that there's so many opportunities here now that we live in Portland. Mercury was having a great time exploring all of this sniffy sniffy smells. He was wearing his superhero t-shirt for the first part of this video that comes off. Um, this was a very stinky log it seems. Mark had lots of things to sniff with it. We were looking, oh here we were looking at a huge boat and I was super proud of Sirius. She can be a little sound nervous sometimes, sound sensitive, and this huge, huge boat came past and blew its horn and she was completely fine with it. She was just curious about what it was and that was really exciting to see. Mercury is super bomb proof and doesn't care about those sorts of things. He was having a ton of fun exploring, wandering around in the sand. Uh, it was sunny and actually quite warm that day. So that was really nice to see um, for all of us. And that is his favorite weather. Here we are. T-shirt came off. I forgot it's a T-shirt that he um, can pee on. So oops, I had to change, change him, pull his shirt off. And it was warm, so he wasn't too unhappy about that. And then there were trails. So we were walking along some of these um, just really nice paved trails, which I'm a fan of. They're nice and wide. Um, this trail was sand back down to the beach, but I really like that at this park, the trails are really wide. It is a leash only park, which makes me very happy. Um, so we are, we tend to then not get super surprised by off leash dogs, which I'm always a fan of. Um, much less of an issue now uh, since Charlotte passed. Um, my two dogs are dog social, but I don't need to engage with people's off-leash dogs coming out of nowhere. So that's a nice thing. There were some off-leash dogs here, but they were um, much less prevalent than a lot of places. Here Merck is climbing over some driftwood, enjoying the sand. We went back to the sand to um, on our way back towards our car, Sirius then got very, very wet. Um, but it was a really saving sticks. It was a really beautiful day. And, you know, any time that I can spend time with my dogs, uh, getting them to fun environments is a really, really good day to me. And I love it when <laughs> they're both having fun. And Merck was really happy to be out. And that's, you know, so amazing. He's 17 and a half years old. So I am just thrilled with watching him have fun. And like <laughs> Sirius dunked her head a bunch of times. We had a really great time. Um, just quiet and hanging out at the water. And it was really nice. You know, again, there weren't very many people and that just was really lovely to see. Here's Merck just toddling along. Sirius is walking in the water because of course she is. Oh, but is she going to rescue that stick? No, she doesn't rescue. Th oh, maybe she does. One of her favorite games is, yep, finding <laughs> big sticks in the water and bringing them to land. It definitely scratches a very, very deep Newfoundland itch for her and she's very very good at it other than she was wiping her face on us because she is after all a princess who likes to rescue things and then make sure her face gets dried here she is in the water oh big stick big big stick and we do a lot of long line swimming at different um beaches but not this one this one um they're 
are a lot of submerged logs and things further out. So it's a really dangerous beach to swim at for anyone. So we do not swim here. Um, but we do swim at a lot of other beaches. Which if you watch our videos, you've probably seen by now. Um, I am so excited to really pick up the video making this year if there are videos you would like to see things you would like to know more about about my dogs or my approaches to dog training or things that we do or the stuff you'd like to see please please let me know I am compiling a list of videos we're going to start making this year and want to make sure that what we're making is stuff you're interested in so leave all your video ideas below I will absolutely uh check them out I'm super open to making just about anything with the dogs so I hope you enjoyed this little look at our fun outing to the river and we will see you in another video very very soon have a lot of fun with your dogs and don't forget to like and subscribe bye bye Ooh, I forgot to say that if you are still watching, there is a really beautiful shot of Mount Hood, which we could see from a bunch of the um, walking trails. So that's coming up here as we make our way right off the beach, up some steps, uh, and there we go. We're going to get a nice little view of Mount Hood. It's just so beautiful here that taking the dogs places also involves just gorgeous views of things like Mount Hood. And if you can hear the kitties talking, it's because it's breakfast time.